If you've driven on Highway 200 outside of Sandpoint in recent years, you may have noticed a sign like that one. I mean, hey, how often is it that you see a turtle crossing sign anyways? Well, now that sign has been replaced with this one. The reason? The old sign kept getting stolen by thieves. Game Crossing just doesn't have the same ring to it, especially when you compare it to this, Turtle Crossing. Yes, these are the old signs that graced Highway 200 by the Idaho Club. The Idaho Transportation Department put up the signs a few years ago after a concerned neighbor spoke up about turtle roadkill here. The slow little guys were getting smushed trying to get to apparent habitat on either side of the road. But it wouldn't take long for crooks to get their hands on the unique signage. In fact, rapscallions came back time and time again to swipe the turtle signs. Signs were stolen around half a dozen times, ITD says. So that prompted the agency to do away with them for good. All that's left now appears to be this sign stump. Up the road are these signs. ITD says ultimately replacing the turtle crossing signs wasn't cheap. Replacing just one sign was at least 700 bucks, including labor. The agency hopes the generic game crossing signs will be less desirable. They add that this will hopefully allow ITD crew members to focus on other projects in the area and not the handiwork of some local ne'er-do-wells. In Bonner County, Taylor Vido, Grand 2 News.